adding fields to a custom contact is uh, custom, adding custom fields to an opportunity is very easy uh, with Studio. What we'll do is we'll just go in, we'll create um, an opportunity. And then here, once you create it, you can uh, use Studio to add it anywhere on here. If you want to add the contractors up here, here, wherever you may want, you may want to create a new tab for them. Uh, you can certainly do that, right? We could say um, additional contacts, you know, related um, related to job. And then we could use add, create a many to one, and relate it to a contact. So this will actually relate it back to the contact database, which is what we want, because contractors, installers, and architects are all going to be stored in Odoo as contacts. And to go find them, you need to access the contact database which is exactly what we're going to design here. And now you'll see, once I do this, we have three new fields, and I can rename those fields, right? I could say this is the um, contractor. This is the architect. And this is the architect contractor installer. Very easy to add those to an opportunity. And just like that, you'll be able to go in and access from your list of contacts, maybe, you know, your, all these people. And if you look at the contact database now, there's only two people. So your contact may be John Jones, and he may be considered, you know, one of your installers. You'll have Mike Harris as an uh, architect and, uh, oops, Randall Jones as the um, someone else, whatever the last one is. All right, contractor, John Jones, installer, Mike Harris, and the on contractor, Randall Jones. Save it. And now you'll have your opportunity with those associated values. So you can look and list, and you can add those here if you want. You could say, um, show me who my contractor is in this list view. Show me who my installer is, and show me who my architect installer contractor. Right? You can have those all displayed in that list to you if you want. You don't have to, it kind of looks pretty cluttered, but I mean, and you don't even have to have those displayed there to group because you could easily group by architect. Shows all deals associated with Randall Jones. Uh, you can also have a nice uh, filter view, which allows you to, um, if I go down here, have auto completion. So I could say auto complete by architect, by installer, or by, oops, not contractor, but then installer. Close it. So now I could say the architect is Randall Jones. You'll see up here, it auto defines architect, contractor, installer. I could say search all installers by Randall. Nothing. I could say give me all opportunities with the architect Randall. Give me all, right, we could say um, we'll have Nick Kaczynski as well to add some complexity here. Something, whatever works. And you'll be able to say um, show me all installers with Nick or Nick is an architect shows me all those deals, so it automatically filters everything out. Now, let's say you also go and create a new quote, and you want to communicate onto this quote all these additional people. No problem. From the opportunity. Additional contacts. And you create what's called a related field. So I can go create, relate, and what I'm relating back to is the opportunity. So from the actual opportunity, give me the architect's, do I want the architect's phone number, the city the architect lives in, do I want to pull the country, the credit limit of the architect, date of creation, the architect's email, um, right? I could pull all this information, but for the sake of the demo, I'll just pull the architect's name. Nick Kaczynski. Right, so we'll just uh, architect... We'll also create one more, and we'll do the installer. So from here, we'll have the
image. Oh, because I have to go back to the opportunity first. So I could pull from the opportunity, the installer, and of that I want the installer's, uh, the installer's name. There should be none because there's no installer associated with that opportunity yet. Correct. And just like that, let's go through and start from scratch. So let's create a new opportunity. We'll call this um, big job. Customer equals John Joe, uh, John Doe. A new customer will create, and we'll add it. Now, if I go open this up, and if I input all my additional contacts related to this job, and then I go create a new quote, the quote looks great, also pulls my contacts automatically here. So these contacts will be automatically associated with that job. If you have any additional questions on how any of this works, just let me know, I'm happy to review.